Christmas, many of us will go through a whole lot of holiday stress. So how do you handle the stress and can you even prevent it? Well, that is where Shelly Fidel, a psycho with psychotherapy, a psycho. <laughs> I was like, that came out so bad. That is so not That's what okay. I meant. That's so not it, what it, I Well, meant. my children I can agree with you at times. Coma, yes, hustle, that's hustle, okay. Fog. I need to talk to this yeah, lady more often. Okay. You are a psychotherapist. Yes. Oh yes. my goodness. Yeah. Okay. Oh, awesome. Yeah. There's like a thousand people, right? You just kind of set up right here. Oh, it all yeah. It's, like all it's completely all packed out. You're getting photo bombed. <laughs> <I know. laughs> So, anything else you guys wanted to say? Oh, we're just glad to be here. Move yeah. to Denver. Actually, don't. Anybody move to Denver. Yeah. More for us. Yeah. Uh, did, you, did I have you say and spell your name already? I forget. No, Louisa. L-U-I-S-A. Okay, and your last name? Morgan. M-O-R-G-A-N. And you? Hannah, H-A-N-N-A-H, Madison, M-A-D-I-S-O-N. We also got a little toy I'd like to try to play with, if you like. This is a willy sphere. Okay. And this makes a perfect circle. Oh, yeah, that's cool. Oh, wow. wow, look at that. Where do you get that all this really stuff? Cool. Um, these you can buy and those ones I make. Huh. Uh, no, you know that? The tools wow. in your hand are... What did I just make there? What? Hold on. Sphere. Oh my Go gosh. <laughs> I gotta get rid of that. <laughs> I gotta get this rid of it. This is really should go. go. Oh, maybe really? it's time to go. Listen, we, really should we gotta go. go. We'll make sure we're together. <laughs> Don't ever give me one of those tools again. Oh my gosh, adopt her. Okay, Charlie, I'm gonna sit here and just hang out with my new best friend, Bettina. Really? Get to weather. Oh yeah. I think you should. You two should get a. Uh, get a hotel room or something. That's a lot of <laughs> lot of action going on over there. Oh, Charlie. Probably the most action you've had in months, huh? <laughs> Let's take a look at the weather forecast. <laughs> oh, well, I crack myself up if I don't crack anyone else. <laughs> 69 degrees. On <laughs> any time, hey, uh, Jake. That's Jake fun. is our uh, our producer upstairs, and um, that was fun. Jake. Josh is our director. Anytime you guys want to recume a man's wang swang <laughs> and just roll that. Like literally, I don't care. It can, whenever you want to roll that in the show. Thank <laughs> God, God listen, you guys are the best. Bob, this is Bob is going to aspire to this now. See, because Bob, I think you could do this. I think I could. I I Man. think with practice you could do that. Swang swang. And then I will start calling you swang. I have to drive the All right, right. Lisa, and, and because you have tights on. From Route 66, the MAD, which stands for Mobile Adventure Design Scooters. They are electric. They go up to 25 miles an hour. They are amazing. Oh boy. And we oh are boy. out of here. Oh All right. Oh All right. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, dear, oh. I'm good. Oh. Oh dear. I think I'm okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No. no, 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 stay. Just stay here. Am I okay? Just stay here. Uh, we'll okay. take care of you. Marcellus, thank you. Workers at a highway maintenance building in Mattoon are also using water in buckets to wash their hands. Their water has been shut off because the state can't pay the bill. IDOT says it's because there's no state budget. <laughs> no state budget. A couple weeks ago, they had to close the rest area. <laughs> Excuse me. In Marshall, there's no word yet on how many facilities or workers are affected. The governor and leaders in the state and Senate are set to meet for the first time in six months. The meeting next Tuesday. The meeting next Tuesday is expected the beginning of budget talks. Karen Swanson is out on the weather patio. Hi, Karen. Hi there. Uh -oh. <laughs> You've been cleaning up your basement and we're cleaning up the backyard here, it looks like. <laughs> it's a little loud out here this afternoon. Tell them to turn off the blower. <laughs> All right. Uh, good afternoon for any activities you may be <laughs> Can you hear me?
hear me? Yeah, now we can. Okay, we can. I, can't, I can't hear myself. <laughs> Apparently, he doesn't know what this business Sir, is. Sir, you're on television. <laughs> That's what we do here. We appreciate the work he's doing. Though. We do, we do. And it's maybe a good afternoon to clean up <laughs> your yard as well. I don't know if I can do this. We, we go to Loki, who is, of course, Thor's brother, to talk about the bad weather coming in here. So, so Loki, uh, what have we got there? Well, you know, my uh, brother from another brother has been misbehaving. Um, <laughs> the God of Thunder has, um, has brought his, uh, his skill set to bear on the local weather, <laughs> shall I say. So there is this huge storm front coming in, and um, the, all that means is that Chris Hemsworth has taken his hammer, and he's <laughs> smashed it on the surface of the sky, and it's going to rain a hell of a lot. So uh, good luck with that. And um, back to you, sir. Very good. That was <laughs> okay. awesome. Way to go. Right. Loki with the weather there, Tom. That Thank was you. terrific. Yes. Thank hopefully, you very much, guys. Hopefully Thor's hammer will not come down too hard on us this afternoon. One last beauty shot of Burriti. Mm. Oh. oh. I like that. He's kind of sniffing everything. Man, like, that's a oh, lot of slobber. That. Wow. Oh, Burri <laughs> what? Where is this going? Where is this going? All right. All right. God. <laughs> what is happening? All right. Oh. Oh. They always say animals and children <laughs> right? on TV. You never you know. Go. Okay. Privacy, please. Are you okay? Through my personal Ashley? Place. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. I'm here. Barini, she's oh married. Oh, my gosh. She's married. And he's like nine months old, too. He's getting a little Yay. freaky. Hey there, fella. <laughs> hey there. <laughs> Slow down. This is good TV. Let's just keep it here. <laughs> Ashley's like, are we done? Okay, he's done. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Wow. Now let's have a look at the weather, uh, Louise. You're right. <laughs> so we through. I think we've lost her. Uh. I'll tell you what. We'll do that. Come back to me on camera three. <laughs> now let's get a weather update. Here is Louise Lear. Thank you, Simon. Good evening, everybody. I'll try and keep it together because it's not a laughing matter with the weather in Scotland today's view. <laughs> Sorry. It's been pretty wet and windy with the strongest of the gusts of wind across Scotland and Northern Ireland. In fact, we've seen gale force gusts into Wales and across the drifts and the parts of England. We've had some... Sorry. We've had some sunshine with highs of 24 degrees. So that's 75 Fahrenheit. Let's move back to this area of low pressure that's been sitting across the northwest. <laughs> He said he'd had an emergency defecation situation and needed to use her bathroom, but the judge in the case found he had a sexual motive. <laughs> an emergency oh, no, defecation <laughs> situation. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, carry on, Hillary. <laughs> yeah, just I as you think I'm having one myself. <laughs> <laughs> because this next story is so tragic, I cannot be laughing. Right. Investigators believe a bomb caused the explosion on a plane which has just taken off from the Somali capital of Mogadishu. The blast blew a hole in the side of the plane, and one of the 74 passengers on board was sucked out, which is terrible. <laughs> And I'm not laughing at that. As the plane was at relatively low altitude, there was no violent decompression and it held together. No one is responsibility. <laughs> Today could be the day I lose my job. <laughs> There's, apparently they're the most popular creatures right now. This oh, time of year. That, beaver that, breeding. Those little guys are cute and cuddly looking. The beavers I've seen are bigger. And uh, not. Yeah, and, and they don't look as friendly. So I, <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I've seen my beavers in the wrong place. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> yes, yeah, weather time. Let's, uh, yeah. Let's, yeah, this afternoon, not too bad. Uh, uh, temperatures in the 50s and 60s. Let's go to the maps. There we go. 56 this afternoon in Tulsa, 62 down toward uh, McAllister. Uh, the next seven days looks pretty rainy uh, for Saturday. Another good chance of rain on Monday. Cold gear uh, for Saturday. You couldn't just take it with weather. <laughs> I can't see him anyway, crying. Anyway, well, today <laughs> today therapy dogs will be sworn in at the Rogers County Courthouse. They will. We will let you know how they will work to help crime victims and children inside courtrooms.
A British man who took on a goat's eye view of the world has been rewarded for his efforts. Because we're all completely trapped inside our own brain and our own perception of the world. I can't make this stuff up. Thomas Thwaites had a set of prosthetic legs built and spent three days living among goats in the Alps. He did it because he, he wanted a simpler life. And he says it was fascinating. A little bizarre though. Thwaites co-won an IG Nobel Prize for Biology with another man who tried living as several different animals. <laughs> the IG Nobel Awards. The IG Nobel Awards honor research that may seem bizarre. <laughs> or amusing. But actually it provokes thought. Kevin <laughs> <laughs> okay, when two clowns <laughs> crashed, it was a <laughs> no laughing matter. And no, it was not part of their act. The two elderly men crashed their minivan on their way to the local fair. The driver, 83-year-old James Billingsley, <laughs> a.k.a. Dimples, the clown, collided. <laughs> He missed the entrance, but when he tried to make a U-turn, he slammed right into an SUV. They're okay. Police say Dimples was wearing oversized clown shoes, but police <laughs> say that they did not play a role in the crash. <laughs> <laughs> Brian has been laughing for the first two time. minutes now. I can't believe you made it through that story. <laughs> and nobody oh. was helping me. No, no, we were actually... Oh. We, Worse for wear laughing, on that one. Oh, man. Sorry, that Roxanne. You that got should through. be part of their act, though. I'm thinking. <laughs> my shoes so my, I need some big clown shoes tomorrow. <laughs> Keep <laughs> you dry from the rain. <laughs> wow. Bye, man. Μπορεί η κούρση στα χίτα. Μπορεί η κούρση στα χίτα στο υποδρόμο να μας μαγεύει. Μπορεί οι κούρσες ταχύτητας του υποδρόμου να μας μαγεύουν, ωστόσο υπάρχουν και άλλα είδη αγώνων με πρωταγωνιστές τα άλογα. <laughs> λοιπόν, μπορεί οι κούρσες ταχύτητας του υποδρόμου να μας μαγεύουν, ωστόσο υπάρχουν και άλλα είδη αγώνων... <laughs> μπορεί οι κούρσες ταχύτητας του υποδρόμου να μας μαγεύουν, ωστόσο υπάρχουν και άλλα είδη... Τα θέλω αυτά. Σήμερα θα μιλήσουμε για τον τρεσάζ, δηλαδή την υπηκή δεξιοτεχνία. <laughs> καλά, καλά. Έλα ρε Φράγκη. <laughs> Σήμερα θα μιλήσουμε για τον τρεσάζ. Μπορεί οι κούρσες ταχύτητας του υποδρόμου... <laughs> Σήμερα θα μιλήσουμε για τον τρεσάζ. <laughs> θα μου φάει τα αυτή. <laughs> Σήμερα θα μιλήσουμε για τον τρεσάζ. <laughs> Την υπηκή δεξιά του. Αυτό μου λείπει τώρα, ναι. Μπορεί οι κούρσες ταχύτητας του υποδρόμου να μας συναρπάζουν. Σήμερα θα μιλήσουμε για τον τρεσάζ, την υπηκή δεξιοτεχνία. Θα τραβήξεις την υπηκή δεξιοτεχνία. And I'm not going to do it, because I shouldn't do this, right, Grandmaster? No. Okay, Grandmaster Bruce Silva here. There's a big demonstration that's coming up next week, Saturday, but for now we have a sneak peek. So we're going to start right over here, is that right? Yes. Okay. 21.2 pounds. That's the brick right there? Right. Okay. And why, why the glass? I'm going to break that concrete slab with that glass without breaking the glass. Okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right, let's go. That's incredible. Wait, no, and 
To be honest, I actually felt these bricks. These are real bricks. I mean, there's there's no joke. Oh, oh, oh! oh. Wow. wow! Check it out, baby. Guns. Guns? How the hell do you do that? Oh, my God. That's right. I bust okay, a witness. Uh, okay, we, okay, we're, okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Was my, was I'm sorry. My <laughs> okay, so we have. Okay, what is this over here? This is 110 pounds. Okay. With the head. Okay, go for it. Don't touch I it. I won't touch it. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Stop. Okay, I'm sorry. Concentrate. You know what? Either way, that was impressive. That was good job. Good job. Okay, so um, lots of discipline goes <laughs> into martial yes. arts. <laughs> yes, it okay. does. Okay, okay. Um, and it's not just you. There's going to be a, <laughs> a big demonstration from other schools, right? Yes. Okay. Right, yes. Okay. <laughs> I, I've got Dixon Taekwondo coming. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Master so this Dixon. is uh, no. <laughs> Saturday, April 30th. By the way. Give us the info. Um, Saturday, April 30th, I'm going to do, well, I'm going to try to do nine world records. And um, this is the first time I'm going to do this and get on Guinness Book of Records. Sounds good. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Grandmaster. We appreciate it. Thank your time. you so much. We'll be right back. You're watching Sunrise. <laughs> yes.